All right, so I just want to show you how to vacuum any visible bed bugs up. Uh, it's an art. Um, it just takes patience, really, and um, you just got to go to town here. So any crack and crevice, search and destroy that entire room, flip it upside down with your vacuum, and uh, turn it inside out. Suck every bed bug you can find. Um, any kind of crumb either. Clean your room while you're at it. So. What you're gonna do is get a shop vac. It doesn't really matter what kind of vacuum as long as it's got good suction because you're gonna be going in cracks and crevices with it um, and something with a hose. So take the hose or you can take the little extension here and take some pantyhose. What you're gonna do is you're gonna feed it through the, the line all the way in there. You don't have to use the whole thing. You could cut it in half if you wanted, but uh, let me fold it over the top. Make sure it's open in there, not all crunched up. And then you're going to want to take a crack and crevice tool, which is, this is kind of our crack and crevice tool. Um, they have other ones too, but that, hook it on there. Whatever attachment you use is going to Hold that pantyhose on there good. Turn on the vacuum. Everything that gets sucked up is gonna go into uh, your pantyhose. So no bed bugs inside your vacuum. Um, if you don't use one of these, you gotta empty the vacuum. You gotta suck up a bunch of baby powder or cornstarch and worry about bed bugs in your vacuum the rest of your life. So um, after you're done, you just grab it. You got a whole bunch of bed bugs in there and a bunch of crumbs and jelly beans and God knows what else. So wrap it up, stick it in a Ziploc, throw it in the garbage outside. And you got rid of more than half of your bed bugs in your room just by vacuuming. Um, so that is the best way um, to initially get rid of your bed bugs.